everybody and welcome back to Jeff playing Minecraft and uh, I'm playing on the Minecraft server and mainly what I wanted to do in this video was make this in order to welcome all the new subscribers that I have uh, so because of this whole contest thing gonna be going on soon that good has discussed on his channel um, everybody really wants to get on that in on that fan server and therefore my subs have shot up significantly for people trying to Man, Endermen have torn up my walls. Uh, for people trying to be able to be in on the, the contest floor for everything that's going on. And hey, that's great. Um, I'm not holding a contest right now. I will be holding it in the future. Right now, Vintage Beef is having his own contest. And for those of you who don't know, I have a fire station here. Oop. Here's my little lockers. Submitted by one of the fans, which I think is beautiful. Um, somebody did suggest that I instead make um, the lockers instead of having one space apart from each one. I have them right next to each other, which I completely agreed with until I realized the logistics. I can't put all these chests together. Um, they don't go together in a big row like that. You can only do two in a row before it screws up. The lockers, however, did cause a problem and make it so I cannot get back upstairs. So I think a temporary fix for that, what I'm going to do is make a stairway that goes just up from here, an outside stairway for now. This is not going to be a permanent fixture, but it's going to... Uh, is this going to be right where... Let's find out. Right where my water pole is. No, it's not. Perfect. Anyway, actually, it ends where the other one ended at, so let me make a new door. And this is just gonna be my temporary little my temporary staircase here. And I don't know why, but I've experienced such major lag in the last uh couple episodes and eh, I kinda don't like that. But this is only temporary, that's just so I don't walk off the edge. So there we go. I'm gonna drop some of this stuff off now. And we unfortunately can't do much adventuring yet. We're going to be upgrading the server at some point to something that's gonna be more able to for us to walk around and do things. I don't need these ten chests, these ten workbenches. That was for more lockers, which will still happen in the future. Um I'm not even gonna finish this pole, because as I showed you guys in the last video, I moved my fire pole so that I could have it more coincide with this. The problem with that is I know when the 1.9 update actually comes out, these are going to be connected to the wall, and it's going to look really funny, but we're going to live with that for now. And what I do need to do still, let's see if, let's see if uh, Packrat has dropped me off anything else. He has not. Just check in my mailbox. I need brick. You know what? I can probably go get brick, because I bet you in this ocean over here there is more clay. Good said there was a crap ton of clay, but I don't know where he took it all from. And I'm still trying to stick in the areas that have already been explored, because I don't want to be taking on a bunch of new, you know, opening up a bunch of new chunks and things like that, because I want this thing to be able to Oh, there's some clay right there. Look at that. There's, there's going to be plenty of clay on this server. I didn't bring a shovel with me, did I? Well, that was dumb. And I'm digging underwater, which also takes a lot of time. So for all you new people out there, uh, you probably have not been following me. Oh. Get up. I can't get up. I'm stuck. I can't get out of this hole. It won't let me swim up. Well, that was ridiculous. Um, well, I'm here. Let's make a shovel <laughs> to make this a little bit easier here. I'm going to make two shovels. Um, yeah, welcome. That's how I play. I like to die quite often. i got to see something when I get back there. Was there no air meter? 
I wasn't even really paying attention because I didn't see my my air meter running out and I don't know if there was one. I guess we just have to guess now or I'm just blind, one of the two. Could be either. Let's go back over there. That was weird though. Usually when you're uh, drowning, you can still swim up. It would not let me swim up for the life of me. I wonder if that's a glitch or if that's a new uh, a new quote unquote feature. So I was right over here. Let me go get all my stuff back. No, I definitely have an air meter. It was just empty. Oh, oh, I was stuck in a current. That's why there's a sick current right there. And uh, because of the fact that I was getting hurt every time I tried to come out of that. Oh my god. Whew. That really gets you trapped in there, huh? Now, where have we explored? Okay, we've still stuck around this chunk here. So I'm just checking this edge for clay. But as I was saying before, for those of you who don't follow me, I've been, um... I was on the Season 2. My Season 2 was on the, the first Minecraft server that went up. And, uh, I got to know Good when he was... He's actually the reason, the, one of the main reasons I got into doing it, uh, Let's Play in the first place. I kind of came across him on the Minecraft forum and uh, started my own. I subscribed to him and watched him pretty regularly, and I subscribed to him. And luckily, I got in when Good was still relatively starting out. I mean, he had a lot more subs than I did, but I think it was about 500 or so when I started watching him. And he was very, uh, very good about looking at people who subscribed to him and checking out their Let's Plays. Like, I didn't even send him a link or anything. I just, one day he sent me a message and said, hey man, you know, I saw that you you subbed to me and I see that you have a Let's Play. He's like, and I really like the Let's Play. So he started watching my series from that, which was good. And that was back in the day when I was doing a video a day, which I don't do anymore. Um, not because I don't want to, but because I don't have time. Um, I try as hard as I can to do as many videos as I can. And I think I, this is probably... The first video I've done probably this week because of the fact that I just um yeah I guess for those of you who don't know me I am a male nurse I work in I live in Washington DC right now and that's where I do my, my nursing gig at nursing is my second career I used to be a computer engineer and I have a master's degree in IT and I just couldn't handle that life anymore I was so bored all the time that I uh I just couldn't do it anymore, so I needed to do something that was more exciting. So I'm an emergency department nurse. Um, I'm also an EMT on the side, which I became after I did nursing. I'm currently in a fire class. Actually, I have my fire one final is uh, Wednesday is my written, and Saturday is my practical. So that will get me to be a technically a full-fledged firefighter, but I still have to go through fire two, which is starts right after that class ends. Um, I do that. I do. The I do a project for the hospital. Like my my computer degree will not go unused because once they found out I had a computer degree, they have selected me to help with their electronic medical record switchover. So that's been ongoing for the last God since March. So you know six or seven months now that we've been we've been dealing with that. And I do you know tr business trips every so often for uh, for things like that. And um. I'm a night shift employee is my technical uh, my technical job role. However, with everything else I do, like these meetings and stuff for the electronic medical record switch over, they don't happen during the night shift. So I do a lot of schedule swapping back and forth. I'm also in a master's program for my uh, for a nursing degree, a nursing informatics. So needless to say, I, I run a very busy life and unfortunately it uh it cuts into my video time i started doing this when i was pretty much only working three days a week and um working as an emt or volunteering as an emt on the side and that's why i was able to do so many more videos all the time and now life has just become very busy and hopefully we'll clear up soon in the next couple months like after christmas things are going to get a lot more cleared up unfortunately this will probably be one of the last videos you see from me in 
another week, maybe two, only for the aspect that I'm moving. And I just moved a couple months ago, for those of you who follow my channel, but I'm moving again, and I'm going to be moving to a much more lucrative area for where I live and things like that. Um, right now, I live so far away from work, it takes me forever, a lot of my day. I mean, I already work 12-hour days, and I spend at least an hour, hour and a half each direction driving to work, so that really makes the uh, makes things rough sometimes. Whoops. Oh, there's some more clay. And you guys are wondering why I'm collecting this clay, because clay is usually not that important. Um, I have a specific thing that I need brick for. I don't actually need many brick. I probably have plenty right now. I don't even remember how to make brick. I think I have to, like, smelt this stuff or something. Throw my clay balls into it. Oh, get out of this water current before I start to die. Oh my god, it's turning night. Gotta get home. Where the heck is my home? I just followed the coastline. I actually... <laughs> there we go. This is more the general vicinity toward town. I'm sure you guys have seen all this stuff already because it's uh, all the other members of the Minecraft server. Their, their houses that I'm sure you've seen in their videos. Or their houses, their inns, whatever you'd like to call them all. And there's mine way back here and there's a zombie sitting at the doorstep. It's okay. Oh man. And this is my fire station, modeled after my real-life fire station, Station 5. Um, not done yet. As many of you know, it does not have apparatus in it yet, because I need wool, which I currently do not have. Oops, I just shut the door. That's not a bad little entrance right there. So I got my coal, or my... uh. my clay going so I can finish off my my 9-11 memorial and there's 9-11 memorial as I explained to people who have previously subbed to me it's gonna be right out here but my fire station actually has a 9-11 memorial and it's got these bricks in it and it's actually only gotta go to here I might make it a little bit bigger I don't know but um, it's got bricks in it and the reason it's got bricks is because people purchase um, bricks and have them engraved for you know remembrance of it doesn't have to be 9-11 um, victims or anything like that, but they have them engraved with names of anybody they want remembered for anything, and they go here with the 9-11 memorial. And we have a piece of the the a beam from the World Trade Center. We actually have one of the I-beams that was in one of the towers, as well as a piece of the Pentagon um, where it got hit from. We have both those pieces. We're the only fire station around that has has a piece from both Wait, did this Enderman steal my glass? I don't think he did. I actually think it's... Ah, there we go. It just connects in. That's not going to be that. It's going to be the, the special brick. I still got to kill my starter house that's over here. I got to get all this stuff moved at some point. <laughs> I hear lots of zombies. Where are you guys at? you down here. You sound like you're getting farther away. Yes, you sound farther away over there. You might just be up top. But a contest! I will be holding a contest soon, but I'm not going to be doing it right away. I want to make sure people have plenty of opportunity to join Vintage Beef's contest. Oh, there's an Enderman. Look at the Enderman. Look at all these guys. I don't see any... Well, I see him. I can't wait until 1.9 goes live so I can do some animal breeding. Because I really need some... Uh, I really need wool. Whoa. Whoa. I'm going to die. Give me that string and let me run to safety. Uh, run away. So I'm going back into the safety of my own house. I'll probably build my bricks up. Because I'm sure there's plenty of them done. <laughs> this is probably going to be really dangerous back here. Oh, you know what? My pig's gone. I had a piggy. 
when he is all gone. I need to eat some food too, so I can regen health. Just a couple pieces of bread here in my inventory. I get all filled up here. Except, come on, eat it. There we go. How's this stuff doing? Nineteen, nineteen, nineteen. Go figure. I guess I didn't need. 14, that's probably enough for a good start. Let's go see what I can finish over here. Like I said, I might expand this memorial area because I might make my house a little bit bigger. I have plenty of land. I have My land goes all the way up over here where this zombie's coming in from. My land goes all the way to over here and then back to that fence line. And I have not built appropriately on it. But this will at least be the foundation for for my memorial. Oh, I think I had just enough on me. There we go. And that is currently the memorial. Let's get some flowers. Do I have any bones on me? I do have bones on me. Look at that. Get some flowers. Red flower, yellow flower, red flower, and yellow flower. That'll be enough. Gotta cut the grass here. Or let the grass get all blown up by, by something or other. I mean, obviously it was a creeper. I don't think zombies have started exploding. I don't have any dirt on me. Let's go with some dirt. Cover this hole back up. I know I've got plenty of dirt in here. And I mean plenty of dirt in here. Yeah, just a couple pieces. Nothing big. My game just started running extremely smoothly. It makes me fear. Oh, well, made me fear that I wasn't recording for a minute, but I definitely am recording. So let's see here. I don't know why I need flowers here, but a memorial just seems like it needs flowers. Can I plant them here? No, I need dirt. That's good for now. One short, but we'll get it. But anyways, for all you new subscribers, welcome to my server, or my server, welcome to the Minecraft server where I'm also doing a Let's Play, um, and welcome to my series, and I hope you guys enjoy it and continue to watch, and I will see you guys next time.